It's 1030 at night. And what are we doing? We're talking pricing or repricing. If you want to be selling online in 10 years from now, you're going to have to be creative on how you do your pricing and specifically you need to be creative in how you're pricing up. There is every reason to price down. Pricing down is going to get you more sales, but you just may run yourself out of business. Here's three quick ideas on pricing. First, a high price is also a signal of quality. If you have good marketing and you're slightly higher priced, people are going to buy that because they want something legitimate that's going to last and, and, and be durable. So don't think that you have to always be at your competitors or below them. Sales will continue if you just have a good product and a higher price can also signal that. Number two, if you're going to run out of inventory, which at some point you're going to, you kind of should, you don't want to like blow all your money on inventory and the fees associated with that. But if you run out of inventory, you should be pricing higher as you get lower, lower in stock. This serves as two things. One, it keeps you in stock longer and two, it's free money. So this Q4, you should look and see if you have any systems that you can automate to price higher as you are running out of inventory. If you're a wholesaler or a reseller, you have to become an expert on repricing. We reprice every 15 to 30 minutes. The theoretical maximum here is about every two minutes, but you're not going to find that out in the wild. You should look at your repricer and see if there's any way that you could shorten that interval. Now, you should also be pricing up as you start a product and as you leave. By doing this, we actually increased our gross margin. Last year, we were at 14.5% average over the entire year. This year, we're trending at 17.5%. And at 60 million in sales, that's a big deal. These percentage points matter. And you, if you're, you have to listen to my podcast episode on this. I cover a lot of details, and there's probably even more ideas that we need to be balancing around each other. I mean, I want you to price higher, because so it allows us to price higher. Let's not price fix, that's actually illegal, but you, you really need to know all the ins and the outs on this. Because like I said, if you don't, you may not be selling in 10 years. All right.